に。Welcome to today's headline. Over 1 million died in Biafra war for Nigerians to survive. Over 1 million died in Biafra war for Nigerians to survive. My dear listener, please, from wherever you're listening from, please stay tuned as I read to this news. We thank God that Nigeria is still one. We should not forget that more than a million died for the nation to survive, Mr. Buhari said. President Mohamed Buhari on Wednesday reflected on the armed conflicts Nigeria had witnessed, including coups and counter coups. Saying more than one million people died in the Biafran war for the country to remain united. The war was fought between the federal forces and the Hebrew soldiers. The president noted that he. Had been part of Nigerians' history since 1967, fighting in the civil war, serving as governor, minister, head of state, and chairman of Petroleum Trust Fund, contesting presidential elections in 2003, 2007, 2011, before winning in 2015. We should thank God, and we should reflect on these things and thank God more, Mr. Buhari stated. He said, challenges faced in the past, including coups, counter coups, and civil war, had prepared the nation for survival. We thank God that Nigeria is still one. We should not forget that more than a million died for the nation to survive, Mr. Buhari said. Estimate of mortality during the war range from 500,000 to 3 million. Another estimate said there were about 100,000 overall military casualties. While between 500,000 and 2 million Biafran civilians died of starvation, Mr. Buhari stated this when he received the Catholic Bishops' Conference of Nigeria (CBCN) executive members at the State House, Abuja. Mr. Buhari noted that the security situation had improved over the years, particularly in the northeast, where the focus had shifted to rebuilding infrastructure and reorientation on education. I just came back from Adamawa and Yobe State. During the visit to both states, I listened carefully to what the people and officials had to say," said the president. And he also said the situation had improved since 
especially in Bono. He added, Boko Haram was just fraudulent and a plot to destroy Nigeria. You can't say people should not learn. The people need to grow intellectually. Mr. Buari told the Catholic bishops that the government would continue rebuilding infrastructural in part of the country affected by terrorist attacks, while underscoring that terrorists have no control over any space in Nigeria. Some people have acknowledged the difference, he added. We have recently deactivated our website comment provider in favor of other channels of distribution and commentary. We encourage you to join the conversation. We thank God that Nigel is still one. We should not forget that more than a million died for the nation to survive, Mr. Buari said. President Mohamed Buhari on Wednesday reflected on the armed conflict Nigel had witnessed, including coups and counter coups, saying more than one million people died in the Biafran war for the country to remain united. The war was fought between the federal forces and the Hebrew soldiers. The president noted that he had been part of Nigerian's history since 1967, fighting in the civil war, serving as governor, minister of state and chairman of Petroleum Trust Fund, contesting presidential election in 2003-2007, 2011 before winning in 2015. So my daily has now come to the end of our today's news. Please do drop by at the comment section and let us know what your view is all about. Thank you for listening.